Christ. All right, points to Alex there, man. <laughs> that was the Hylian symbol. With that, but it wasn't with the Triforce. That was just the bottom. And of course, true Sonic, Sonic Adventure-esque status. Ow. We get the, the phase two of the boss with the theme song. This is kind of blasphemy to me because we're destroying the Hylian symbol. And I'm a big Zelda fan. This, I, I almost feel like I should be chastising myself right now. <laughs> Quick, Alex, the core is exposed! Oh, you say. Oh, there's a lot of stuff. I was gonna say, dude, that is better not frozen. I'm not gonna be a happy drac. Of course. Yeah, good luck hitting him with silver when there's so much shit flying at you. Well, perhaps some shit, huh? Oh. Yeah, uh, apparently he can't. My meter was depleted. Which? It's. Oh, thank goodness. We are actually having slowdown in this level. Oh my god in heaven! Come on, will you? There we go. I can't tell if that did anything. It did. Oh, this is when they got rid of it. It's just delaying so bad that. Ugh. I can't dodge anything because I'm stuck in that stupid ass animation. So it's like pretty much having a ten rain minus ten rain handicap each freaking yeah. time you switch out. Switch, damn it! It's switching. It's just taking its sweet time doing it. I'd love to if you'd actually do anything. But no, you just... Am I gonna have to die? Come on, will you? This is pissing me off. There we go. I'm kind of surprised when you fly back like that, you're not getting... You're not getting hit. Okay. He detects an attack on the core. He will put up a field with the wings of light. We get it, Omega. Shut up. The moment he attacks, your chance. Solaris's core will be vulnerable. Evade his attack, then strike at the same time. Okay, I, I get the logic there. How are you supposed to do that with silver? Because you have to actually take the attack to get ammo. Yeah. Do you understand the problem in your logic here? Da, na, 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 na. Or if Shadow has to sit there for a second, do his animation, and then he gets to hit. There we go. Oh look, we're staring at his butt crack. Solaris has a butt crack. What can I say? Do you want to know what this fight is really starting to remind me of? What? Star Fox. Mm -hmm. Andros. Where yeah. you're focusing on one particular point of Andros, and the only thing that you can do is focus on it, and then you're not paying attention to everything else that's going on. Yes. No, we don't want to let him have it. Not with Silver, anyway. Boom! All right. And of course we lost green to that, because I had to open my big mouth. All right, so we're on Shadow again. I gotta take it back. This boss is not that as well designed as I thought it was. No, it's it's pretty badly designed.
And before people start screaming at me, final bosses are really hard to nail that design, okay? I will actually honestly admit there are a lot of final bosses that just don't feel perfect. This is the end. Oh, so thanks. I'm, thanks a lot. I'm yeah. not faulting this game for its final boss. Yeah, because, you know, everything debris... Aren't those things supposed to go straight? One would think so. Yes. But it's almost like they're like real guns. They have to have a pre-designated course. It's like I either get hit or I or the everything else hits it. I did that too soon. Okay, but you still got the hit. Can you finish it? No. I don't know. I I wouldn't try it with twenty rings. But of course you get hit because. It takes forever for them to finish their animation and that you're still vulnerable. Yes. We get it. You're Super Saiyan. We don't need you to do the posture, okay? okay? Clearly Shadow can't do any more damage. Yes, and I don't think Silver can either. But we're going to try it. Oh, this game is pretty good. Funny you bring that up, Sonic. Er, we're not having... Oh, Got no. him! All right. Okay. Yes! We beat Solaris! Unless oh. there's a phase three. Thankfully, this is the lap. This is defe defeated. I feel dirty. We, we just... We defeated the Hylian symbol. <laughs> All right. Yes! Wow, let's see. <laughs> You're surprised at this. I, I am. I figured I was going to get a D with how long I took. Yeah. I love it. We're, we're supposed to care that we're getting 1,600 rings. Because, you know, we care about stuff like that, right? I never did get to show off the gems and all their coolness. Eh. <laughs> I don't know why. They just disappeared, And even though I bought them. All episodes clear. Yay! Music from last episode is now available in the audio room. Last episode is now available in the theater room. So if you guys want to see Sonic die, you can see him die. Or if you want to see tons of bestiality, you can see tons of bestiality. All right, we have defeated the evil. So what's what's this going to do for us? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Strike a pose. Did you destroy it? No. Atreyu, did you call my name? <laughs> This is Solaris, the flame of hope. It's so beautiful. When the flame has grown large enough, our world will change. Solaris will allow us to control time and move through history. People will be able to rectify past mistakes and avoid bitter fate. Will we be able to see Mama? Yes, Elise. We'll both be able to see your mother once again.
This is where everything began. Who knew such a tiny flame could bring such devastation? If we put out this flame, Solaris will never exist. And then we'll never have to worry about the flames of disaster, right? But our encounter... You and I will never meet. It will never have happened. Put out the flame right now! I... To tell the truth... I don't care what happens to the world! Just smile. Did this game just do what I think it did? Yes, it retconned itself. But... It literally retconned itself. Oh, I feel a rain's coming in. Say this is a pretty nice scene. Nice way to end it. All right, is that it? We're done? That's it. That's F over. this game right into the ground. It literally retconned itself. It means nothing. This whole plot line, everything we've been building up to at this given moment means nothing. Absolutely nothing. F this game right into the ground. Would have had more meaning that would have had more power if there was so much not wrong with that whole process that's that's my problem with this whole thing you had in order to release the flames of disaster you had to make her cry okay why didn't mephilus just go and poke her a dozen times <laughs> to get her to cry stop picking on me and then at that point he wins yes we and at, and at that point, technically, Elise would have been five years old, which means Sonic wouldn't have existed, and Silver would not have messed around with her timeline. So at that point, he would have won. Yes. It would have been his world. It would have been... Com you could have, we could have avoided all this, Mephilus. You could have just pushed her down a flight of stairs when she was a child. 
Or even just, like, put a banana peel right in front of her. Just to make her skin her knee. <laughs> that's literally... That's the problem here. Sonic's death means nothing! Because this could have happened at any point in this game. It just so happened to be the Bambi moment of killing off the icon, which everybody knew was never going to be continuity. Uh, I'm sorry, to the people who love Sonic 06, good on you! I can't join you in this. There are so many There's things so wrong many problems. with this game. Alright, this is the point where we actually start going into our final thoughts, boys and girls. My final thoughts are very simple. This game was broken. This game had every problem going into its development. The only thing that was going for it was its trailer. Excuse me. And then, finally, just... Holy crap! The story writer... The, it really feels like the writers did not give any kind of weight to what they were doing. They should not have done a time travel plot. Mm -hmm. because those are so hard to pull off and pull off well at that point especially since it just the story just basically retconned itself yeah it means nothing so that's that's my opinion and I, I, I've sat through this horror I have no respect for this game I understand that you guys do I cannot join you in that we can agree on many many other things I cannot join you in this one so, there you go. People can hate me all they want, dislike this video, whatever. But I cannot join you in this. Alex, you you may have to curb the hatred here. I can't curb it. This There are too many problems with this game. It's a combination of bad studio politics, bad design, that which led into bad design. Sega wanted to push it out the door quickly. Sonic Team wanted to go bigger and grander than ever. Nobody just knew when to st sit, step back and say, Hey guys, maybe we should tone it, tone it down a little so... Maybe we should merge the teams again. Maybe we should not worry about the Wii right now. Yeah. Get out the PS3 and the 360 versions. And then go to the Wii and develop a game for it. Yes. I, I agree with you. This is way too many Sega politics problems. The only thing that seems developed in this game is music and that's not saying much because I will say that there are bad audio tracks in this game the town music is painfully bad the jungle music some of the levels are okay the problem is is that they grate on you because you keep on hearing them yes I, I would honestly say the only song that I'm really liking from this was All Hail Shadow I do not like that song. I'm going to disagree with you there. I didn't like it. The Sh only reason I like it is because I think rock works. Rock is fine, I, but I'm not the opinion that Sonic only needs to be rock any more than Sonic only needs but to be big rap? tunes. Rap, does, rap, like, rap may work for Knuckles because yeah. we set that tone. We've not set that tone with Sonic. Yeah, uh, his, world's, well, his world is kind of a nice mix of rap and rock, so... I, I do like his world, but I do not like Al All Hail Shadow, mostly because I think it's a cheesy song. Even uh, I'll, t I'll tell you this, though. This song right now, this feels so out of place. Yeah, this is a love song, basically. This is like, in a Final Fantasy game, this would make sense. This makes no sense for a Sonic game. Mm -hmm. Oh no, there's a Marta, who's a production assistant. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. I, uh, okay, one of, my so, best, one of my best friends is named Marta, so I'm going to have to tease her. So, we've done it, guys. Done we, it. we have done Sonic 06. Let's go ahead and cover what we're going to do next. Now, people might be asking, okay, are you going to a Sonic game this time? We've done a lot of Sonic games in our development. So we're going to take a little break. We're going to take a little break because we want to go into another Legacy franchise. We're going to keep you waiting on what that franchise is, but we're now going to kind of swap this out like we do with the other games. So, just because there really isn't a whole lot of other Sonic games we want to cover. And no, we're not going to go backwards, guys. We're not going to go into the Game Gear games or what or whatnot. It's not going to happen. The only way I've played the Game Gear games is if I'm playing on an emulator with save states, because those yeah. games are hard. Yeah, so it's just not going to happen. I mean, we literally have, like, only a few more games that we want to cover with Sonic. Yeah, so, at that point, we do need to put in another Legacy franchise. And 
pretty much, aside from Sonic Advance 1 and maybe 2, I've never cared much for the handheld Sonic games. Um, like I said, I said this at the, uh, way, way, way back when we started playing Sonic games. If you really want the comprehensive whole Sonic line run through, uh, go watch Clement's channel. Yes. Clement LJ to oh god, I can never remember his channel. Just look up Cl just look up the great Clement. Yeah, but I, I mean, if we were going to be doing the full thing, we'd be doing Doctor Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine. We'd be doing Sonic Spinball, and obviously we don't want to do those yeah. because we don't, you know, havoc. we don't like them. Oh havoc! You are such a good engine, except Sonic or Sega did not know how to use you properly. Um, but yeah, so cool. tune in next time. Like, I, I gotta say, I'm, I'm breathing in a sweet sigh of relief. We're done with this abomination of a game. Yeah. I really did kind of want to show w at least one Dark Age Sonic game. Well, we technically did, because a lot of people actually do debate whether or not Sonic Adventure 2 is the start of the Dark Age. Oh, that, that's such bullshit. So, at that point, you could make that argument, but we've done it. And no then, guys, no Shadow, no... Unleashed, no Secret of the Rings, no Black Knight. We're not doing those. I, I'm not even messing around with the games because I'm I'm worried with this that they put even less effort into that kit. Well, technically, we're gonna do a Wii game. We are. Future. We are. We're gonna do colors at some point. Yes, but but we don't have to worry about that. That's post. They they learn their mistakes. Mm -hmm. Like Secret of the Rings and Black Knight, I don't want to touch because they're just gonna be that bad. But yes, so. We are Dragon Shadow, and this has been a Let's Play of Sonic 06. We are done. We thank you guys for sticking with us during this painful process. I died so many times, yet somehow did the end of the world all in one go. Not a single game over. I'm so proud of myself. No, no, no. We're, we're happy about that. Uh, and to the, to the 06 fans, we love you still. We, we still love you. I hope you guys love us, but... We can't agree with you on this. We love you still. But in the meantime, we are Dragon Shadow, and we will see you guys for the next.